Welcome to Managing Users in Polar Video. For the purpose of this video, the data used is simulated data only. To keep up to date with our latest videos, hit the subscribe button and select all notifications. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Log into Polar. From the Welcome to Polar page, if your user account has the Polar Administrator ticked, you will see the management menu near the Polar logo at the top of the screen. Select the management menu. On this management page, you will see a list of Polar users within your practice. The reports available to your practice and to each user. Only administrators can add, edit or delete users. If you are an administrator, you will have a tick in the admin tick box. To add or remove an administrator or reports visible to a user, simply add or remove the ticks. To create a new user, at the top right hand side, click on New User. Populate the first and last name. The username will be automatically populated with the first name and last name with a dot in the middle. In this example, Polar user has the username polar.user, which is not case sensitive. If a user is using Polar in another practice, you will need to create a different username, for example, p.user. Ticking the group admin tick box makes the user an administrator. Note the group admin tick box is the same as the admin tick box back on the management page. You can have multiple administrators. Note they will have access to all Polar data, including monetized MBS items, as opposed to MBS items only. Please enter your preferred email address. This is primarily used if a password reset is requested. You can create your own password. The minimum password length is 8 alphanumeric characters and is case sensitive. If you use the Generate Password button, a password will be automatically created for you and will overwrite any previous entries. If the password fields are left blank, one will be generated when the user account is created and the user will receive an email requesting a password reset. When complete, click on the Create User button. Please be patient. Sometimes there can be a short delay. You will automatically return to the management page. For users to see their reports, you will need to tick the box of each report. By clicking on the username, you can change their password or send a password reset email within their profile. Note, you are not able to delete an authoriser account who is the authorised signatory to the Polar Agreement. You will need to contact the digital health team at your PHN to assist with this. If you found this video helpful, remember to subscribe to the Emfin YouTube channel and give the video a thumbs up. See you in the next video.